In today's video, I want to show you a motorized computer workstation riser that raises and lowers to whatever level you want so that you can stand, you can sit while working at your desk. We're going to talk all about the cool tech in this workstation up next. Hey everyone, my name is Jeff and on this channel I do all sorts of different types of tech reviews, tips, tutorials, and more, so please consider subscribing. Today I want to talk to you guys about this really cool product that's got tech built into it. This is the FlexiSpot uh, Computer Workstation Riser Unit, and this allows you to raise or lower your desk to whatever level you want by just using two easy buttons, and I have to tell you guys, FlexiSpot reached out to me asking if I would review this product, and I want to share this with you guys. I think this is a great unit to help save your back from having to constantly bend over or stay sitting at your workstation, having that ability to raise and lower your desk so that you can be standing, you can move around, get some exercise while you're doing whatever work you want to do on your desk, I think is a great option, and you can do all of that with this unit. So in this video, I want to show you the unboxing, the quick and easy setup of this unit. I'll show you how it works and how you can use it to make your life a little bit easier at your office. In unboxing all of this material, uh, you start off and you do get the instruction manual. You do get a catalog showing you different options that FlexiSpot offers as far as desks and other equipment. And then inside the box itself, you get the two main pieces. Uh, you're going to get the actual motorized workstation and then there is the keyboard tray that is set at just a lower level than the actual workstation itself. Now, in addition to that, because it is electric and it's got that motorized lift, uh, there is a uh, plug, an AC plug, that also comes with the unit, and then you just put that together and then plug it into the desk. Very simple and easy uh, setup. Probably took me to unbox it and put the whole desk together 10 to 15 minutes, and then it was operational and very, very simple, clear instructions. And real quick, as we do in all the videos on this channel, we've hidden Tinker. Tinker is our little hidden robot, and he briefly pops up in all the videos on this channel, including this video. So if you happen to spot Tinker, be the first person to let me know the timestamp, the amount of time into this video that you spotted Tinker, our little hidden robot, popping up. Let me know that timestamp down in the comments section below. If you're the first person to spot him, we will put your name on our Tinker Ford Hall of Fame page, as well as we'll give you a shout out in one of our future videos. So I'm going to talk to you about the size and dimensions of this desk. So as far as width, this is roughly 36 inches inches wide. This top desk area is 16 inches deep. You've got this keyboard tray that's underneath it and that is roughly 8 inches deep and the same width. And then there are clips that hold this keyboard tray on. So if you don't want to use that and you just want this top workstation, you can simply unclip those and then pull the keyboard tray out. Uh, the base has a nice metal sturdy base to it. That eliminates it from a lot of different shaking. You'll know Notice as I'm trying to wobble this here, not really going anywhere. The monitor is wobbling more than the actual desk itself. And in case you're wondering, the table that I've got the set on for demonstration purposes is roughly 30 inches high. And then the extension to the top of this keyboard tray is going to be from the floor up to this keyboard tray, 46 inches. So 46 inches, pretty comfortable height for me to be able to do whatever typing I want. And then I've got the monitor set up on top of that as well. So when I'm using the desk, you can set it to any height you want by using the uh, raise or lower buttons. It takes about 15 seconds to fully lower it down onto the existing table that I have or desk. Uh, and then same thing to raise it all the way up. You can stop it anywhere in between to get the keyboard height right where you'd like it. And I'll show you here. I'm just going to simply push the uh, down button to bring it down. And whatever height I want it at, if I wanted it right there. I can hold it and then go ahead and do whatever typing I want. I can continue to bring it all the way down to the table and uh, there's some pads on the bottom of 
this keyboard tray. Now I'm ready to sit. And from this point, sitting down, now I can do whatever computer work I want to do. There's technically enough space on this workstation where if you did want to have two external monitors, you could do that as well. So if I've been sitting for an extended period of time and now I want to get up, stretch my legs a little bit, I can simply extend the uh, workstation back up by just pressing the button. That is going to lift it to the area where I can stand uh, and then finish doing whatever work I want to do with this workstation at whatever height I want to set it at. It's now all the way up, fully extended. And you're probably wondering how far up does it go? The extension uh, to being fully raised up is 20 inches from whatever tabletop or desktop you're putting this uh, motorized riser on. So located just underneath the uh, main top area is this metal plate and they also include what looks like little chess pieces but these are actually magnets and you can stick these right onto this metal plate. Very ingenious uh, and that allows you to magnetize, put any type of notes up here or if you've got like any business cards that you want to stick up here to have some sort of notes as you're doing work, you've got this metal area that you can can basically stick magnets to. Now they've also thought of cable management and they do include some sticky cable ties that you can use to fasten your cables as well as velcro pieces. The velcro pieces can be used then to secure any of your cables making your whole desk look neat and tidy. I personally feel that when I'm standing I'm a little bit more productive. I've got more options as far as being able to move around um, even just kind of walk in place as I'm standing at my desk, I find that I'm less likely to kind of slouch in my chair or even get as sleepy because I just am a little bit more alert in a standing position. So you've got options with this workstation where you can raise and lower it depending on what mood you're in for that day. Now, if you want more information on this workstation, uh, FlexiSpot does have a whole bunch of information on their website and I will leave uh, links down in the video description below where you can check out more information about this particular raising and lowering desk. So I'm interested to know where would you use this desk? Would you use it at home? In a home office? Would you use this at your work? Let me know down in the comments section below. This is Tinker Ford. As always, I appreciate you watching. Be sure to make every day awesome. You can check out other tech and gadget reviews I've done on this channel. They'll be cards popping up here as well as more links down in the description below. You don't want to miss any of those playlists. Great gadgets and great tech for you guys. Be sure to make every day awesome and I will see you in the next video.